All right, so now Christian and I constantly ask myself is why am I doing this? Uh, and more importantly, why am I recording it? Like what's so important about recording it? Uh, well, so the why am I doing it? The why is simple. 48 years old, uh, did a lot of stuff when I was younger, last 13, 14 years, like I've been missing from myself, I've been missing from any activity. I, you know, focused on my health about six years ago by just eating plan and it was literally just eating out of a smaller plate. But as that habit, my body got used to that habit, the effectiveness of that sort of weight, um, and yeah, you know, I was I started to pick up weight again, and also just I wasn't that strict with it. But more importantly, it's because I started to uh, do things like not on the couch. Like I got off the couch and out of the house, and I went out and I did things, taking walks, uh, you know, um, in a nature reserve, around the neighborhood, around the campsite, uh, around anywhere, literally. And that evolved into taking short runs. And I set a challenge for myself to try and run 5Ks as often as possible. You know, talking about like the effort in the beginning uh, doesn't um, come near to the reward that you get. Meaning that the effort is so huge that the reward that you get actually, you know, can't compare. It's so tiny. But that's if you're using the wrong measuring stick. And then that led to me running up Table Mountain twice. And so I started to sort of have this. I almost feel like it's a portal that opened up in my mind that said you can do what you think is impossible. And so that's why I'm doing this. That's why I've entered the Niza Forest Marathon. I've never done a marathon before. Uh, I'm training for it now. And like with just two months before the race, like it's less than two months now, the marathon's on 22nd of June. Today is the 30th of April. So not a lot of time. And to try and get the distance in, is incredibly hard that factored with two busted knees a couple of years ago not being able to run not being able to do much of anything that's really the challenge it's it's mental the physical body whatever just has to deal with what i mentally am setting myself up to achieve so that's the why that's the because i i, I should be able to do this like there's nothing that's there's nothing, no excuse that says I can't do this. I should be able to do this. Like, so at 48 years old, let me go try. All right, that's the, that's the why am I doing this? Why am I recording it? Uh, to document my journey. It's not for anyone else. It's for me. If there is somebody else out there who felt similar to I did or is in a similar position or was spending a lot of time on the couch and thinking that they can't, like, I am not fit. I mean, this is not a fit body. But like, look at this. Look at that there. Huh? I mean, there's, there's a little bit less now because of the training that I've been doing. But mainly, I'm not fit. Like, I struggle sometimes. This morning's race was a struggle for me to just... Or not race. The morning's run was a struggle. Like, I really didn't want to. Like, my body's still sore from Saturday's run. I um, got all these ideas. Like, I want to do a 30k this weekend. But... It's not going to happen, so I just have to adapt, I have to take it easy. And more importantly than that is that every single time I've felt this way and I've gone out for a run, i felt better. I know what it's like to go, no, I'm not going to run and then not run. And then that becomes a day, two days, a year, three years, six years, 14 years. And I'm just not up for that. I'm just not up for another 14 year break. And that's why I go, no matter how I'm feeling, I go for the run. If I finish the run and I'm still sore and I'm out, and I'm like, oh, I should have rested, but at least I went out. And if I go out and I feel great and I go like, oh, thank goodness I went out for the run because now I feel great. So that's why. That's why I'm recording it so that I can document the journey of how I felt and other people might not be inspired, but just think like, wow, this fat so can do it and I can do it too. So go for it. Go take that time. I'll see you on the road.